Hello, my loves. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Please pardon my appearance. I wasn't expecting this message at all, actually. In fact, today is Friday, which is usually my day where I'm kind of recapping the end of the week and putting everything in the apothecary kind of in its order, making sure that things are clean, cooking, all those other things. It's interesting though, because as I was doing all of that, I was took a, a moment to do the daily poll for Bahati Life Love Notes. And I had this thought, you know, I haven't received a very specific direct message from the divine in quite some time. I typically don't force it. I allow it to come in as it does. But I found that it was so interesting that I hadn't received anything for, I think, over two weeks now. I think it's been over two weeks. And as soon as I said that, I received a download. So this is a very specific message, but it has been confirmed 1000% that the year 2023 for many of you guys is going to be the year of engagement, marriage, and union. Spirit was very clear that this isn't going to be twin flame and soulmate type of connections because those relationships have come with a lot of growth. This is going to sound so controversial, but please just um, be open to hearing this. But yeah, those, those twin flames, those soulmate relationships have required a lot of growth. You are going to meet your life partner, but for many of you, that life partner is going to be very stabilized somehow, some way in the futures to come, like in the future to come after you meet your, your, your life partner, there is a high chance that for many of you guys, you'll have some type of, um, entanglements of sorts, um, where you'll have, you'll actually have, uh, this, those soulmate connections, twin flame connections that do come with lessons. And then for other of you guys, you're going to have very peaceful, grounded, stabilized relationships with your life partner who is separate from soulmate twin flame connections of your past. The way that you'll know this is if you've had a lot of ups and downs in the majority of your adulthood with really karmic connections that are very, have like the soulmate twin flame fingerprint on it, or if you have very tumultuous upbringing, you're going to find yourself stabilizing in a life partner type of relationship. That is not something that is glorified in the spiritual community, but it is something that the divine really, really wants you to seek, to ask for, and to strive for, and to start looking for. Um, Spirit is also was very clear to me that the soulmate twin flame connections, they provide a lot of growth, but they started being glorified and people started seeking them and calling them in. So there has been a lot of tumultuous energy when it comes to relationships and love and what Spirit says is loving patterns. So how we kind of repeat our, our the relationships that are repeating in our lives. Spirit wants you who's watching this video right now to be very open to receiving your life partner relationship and to in the new year, be open to letting the past go. Let bygones be bygones. Forgive family members, uh, friendships, things that have traumatized you and hurt you, expectations that it is that you have for what love relationships have to look like. They're going to start working and have, they've already started. Um, they will begin revealing to you what this life partner is going to look like. This life partner relationship is going to defy like traditional. It's going to be something that it's stabilizing for you. It's actually something that you need not so much what is that you want when you see it you'll recognize it because it's going to be the sense of coming home and a sense of completion um and you will have spirit is very clear that you will have moments where in that life partner relationship there's going to be like crossroad type times maybe like three to five to ten years from the time that you come together with that life partner where you're going to have to choose whether to stay solid in that life partner relationship or if there's going to be um a, a choice that's made if you're going to invite in a soulmate twin flame relationship or if you're going to deviate from your path with your life partner there is no right or wrong um answer with this again this is not traditional so this is how spirit sees you and your path so if you decide that you want to deviate from your life partner the stable relationship this healthy relationship which 
if you're not accustomed to stability, then it can feel boring or can feel um, like you want some more engagement or something. I don't know what that is. Um, then you have you will have a crossroad moment where you can decide if you want to go down that path. Right now in this moment, you're not going to be able to answer for that. And right now in this moment, you may not even think that you would say yes or no to a situation like that. You'll cross that bridge when you get there, but you'll know it when you come to the crossroads. Right now, though, Spirit is saying that without any judgment um, and without looking too far ahead into the future with expectant eyes um, of what is to come, just be open and start preparing your energy, your house, your home, your heart, your mind, and your life for this life partner connection that is very stable, very healthy, very um, nurturing and thriving. Something that spirit sees has been, you've been lacking for quite some time. Um, yeah, so that's the message. Um, you're gonna, if, if you guys are not someone who's dating right now, or if you don't have anyone in mind, or if you haven't been connected with this relationship yet, be don't be surprised if by this, you know, in the year 2023, that there is rapid movement, rapid forward movement with the person that is that you meet and, and engagement, marriage, moving together. Things are going to start moving very, very fast, very rapid. Um, be open to that. However, spirit, as I'm saying that, spirit is saying that if there's a part of you that is resistant to it, um and a blockage that you refuse to let go it will a thousand percent delay the process and spirit doesn't judge you in that but spirit wants you to again start quickly moving past those blockages for the sake of this generational blessing that's coming through so some of you guys will leap ahead with this some of you guys will walk into this some of you guys will be running into this some of you guys will be stumbling no, regardless, take those steps and be open. <clears throat> prepare, again, spirit saying, prepare your heart, mind, soul, spirit, home, specifically your home environment. If you have to clear out clutter, do that. If there are things that spirit started inspiring within you when it comes to, okay, start changing your diet plans, all of those things, it's not because you're in alignment with a twin flame or a soulmate. It's because you're moving, you're actually moving away from those karmic type of connections and you're moving into alignment, into a lifestyle. Um, I just heard like a time period. So it's going to be a lot of people that are migrating into this where they're, they're prioritizing their bodies in different ways. Life is going to start taking like, I don't know why I'm getting this so strongly, but it's almost like a housewife's role or traditional roles where um, things are going to be more centered around the home environment. So it's going to be so important that feminine and masculine energies, regardless of how they show up in your relationship or in your life, that they're balanced because that's what spirit is striving for. We are not going to work as hard as we have in the past. Things are going to be more stuck on um, making sure that the home is something that is stable, loving, supportive, and we're going to start saying goodbye to the tumultuous ups and downs. Divorce rate is going to plummet in the near future, and marriages are actually going to kind of, I don't know why, but I'm hearing like even out, and they're going to last longer, um, and this is going to be a new generation. So I hope this reading makes sense. Um, literally go to this, go to the divine <clears throat> at your altar, or in your prayer space or whatever it is and consult spirit directly ask if this message includes you i don't want to speak for the divine for every single one of you but this was a message that came through really clear um and you guys will have to let me know but 2023 is going to be the year of really amazing life partner unions very stable healthy solid relationships and the building up of the importance of the family dynamic from a place of health love thriving authentic energy and i'm 100 percent here for it okay especially if you're someone who has not had that or has not experienced that more more for you to really start preparing for it do not expect that if you're a product of divorce or tumultuous um relationships in your upbringing in your childhood that that is going to repeat literally forgive all of that cross it out and start preparing for the fact that it can and it will happen for you and it's going to be happening in the year 2023. You guys are going to have to let me know how this manifests for you and how it plays out. Until then, thank you so much for hanging out with me. 
Um, if you want to, Bahati Love Notes are up for you. I shuffle every day for you guys. It's my opportunity to channel and share my messages. I'm not offering any other readings. So if anyone's approaching you in the comments, either here on YouTube or any other uh, social media platform, especially um, TikTok or Instagram, that is not me. Bahati Love Notes is the only thing that I'm offering and that can only be found at Bahati Life. Um, and if you're worrying if it's authentic, it can only be signed up for on my actual official Instagram, which is at Bahati Life or BahatiLife.com. Okay, guys, I love you so much. I'm going to go back to cooking. I hope that you have a wonderful new year if I don't hear from you or if I don't show up on YouTube before that. Um, and I will see you guys in the new year. Bye.